Welcome to Real Estate with Brenda Kay. I'm Brenda Kay with the Halifax Home Selling Group. Wow, what a world we're in, eh? With COVID and all the time that we're spending home. So I thought what I'd do is I'd speak to an expert on uh, decluttering and how to organize your home. And she actually has a virtual company. So please join me for the following video with Kitty McKay from Clutter Solutions. Hey, Kitty, how are you doing today? Fantastic, Brenda. How's yourself? Good, good. Kitty, thank you so much for, for joining me here today. Tell us a little bit about your business. Well, uh, I'm Kitty, Clutter Solutions by Kitty, and I specialize in virtual decluttering, which is a less intrusive, more focused way to get your chaos under, your con under control. Declutter, no, we start with clutter first. <laughs> I like that. So Kitty, what made you choose? Uh, well, first of all, I just want to say you're always virtual. You've always been virtual. So you didn't do this because of the pandemic. So tell us, why did you choose to do it virtually? Well, I actually was doing it in person here in Halifax, um, helping helping primarily people who were, who were right-sizing, helping them to decide what to keep and what to toss. And then about close to two years ago, I heard about virtual decluttering through my business coach. And I looked into it and it, it's not practiced very widely, but really it is the way to go because people feel less, again, intruded on um, it and they can choose which room it is that they want to that they want to address they don't have to clean the whole house they clean for the cleaning lady kind of thing so it's it's um, economical from a financial standpoint from a privacy standpoint it, it just seems to work for people they say that you know uh, I wouldn't have had you in my house I just would have left it this way but this way it's it, it's just easier for all concerned do you think some of it is that they're overwhelmed by every room that needs to get done so by having you virtually you only see that one area to start with and it and it's not as overwhelming Absolutely, it's a, you can focus better be, it, on on just the one room. Then sometimes people have difficulty deciding which room, and then I usually recommend the bedroom or the entrance, depending on depending on the situation. There are some parameters that you can follow, but it's um, it is easier to just focus on one room, one room at a time. Yeah. So during this pandemic how is your business going because i know myself i've pretty much decluttered everything in my house looking for something to do and um, probably could have used some really good advice although you've given me tips before so i did use them yes uh, so how is it during this pandemic oh it's been busy there's a lot of interest uh it's um it is so much so that and of course people are are lonely that they you know they're reaching out as you say they they want something to do they know that this is the time that they should be doing it and it they it's it's been it has been certainly busier good good do you find kitty um is there a certain um, age maybe that calls you or a certain demographic or is it just all ages? I've had uh, one person um, who um, as young as 30 years old but the majority are uh, 40 to <clears throat> between the 40 year old to 70 year old age, age range uh, simply because they've accumulated more things and people who struggle with ADHD, um, they they tend to make up the majority of of my of my private clients, and they have more difficulty with decisions, uh, making decisions, and focusing and staying on a task. So they find that my quote one system, which gets you to focus on one room at a time, one area at a time, one thing at a time, uh, they find that it help helps them a lot. I like that system that you just mentioned, the one room, the one area, the one thing. And, um, and specializing in ADHD um, would be really helpful for a lot of people, especially virtual. You're only seeing that one area that's not going to overwhelm them. Exactly. Yes. Yes. It's, it's, it's much, uh, much, 
more focused. Mm -hmm. So how many coaching or how many virtual visits do you do, say, for the average room, the average bedroom, say? Oh, um, now if they need to, and if they need decluttering in one room, they tend to need it through through the entire house. But generally, I uh, usually about three sessions. My packages uh, range from five sessions to ten sessions, but generally it takes about uh, two or three sessions for the average bedroom. Okay, and we move from there. So do you give them some homework, Kitty, to do until the next session, to some, something of an accomplishment to get to? Absolutely, because it's not just about decluttering to make things pretty. It's about making decluttering a habit for life, making it, uh, making it a wonderful place to come home to and keeping it that way. That is the difficult part, is developing habits and systems that you never have to do it again. And that is that is that I think is where the real value is uh, and instilling when you ask about the homework, there's a bit of accountability there. And it again puts the habit into them. Um, a, an example of, of uh, homework would be finish that stack of papers that we that the client and I started on. Finish that. Ah, okay, I've got that. As you say, sense of self-accomplishment and confidence that, wow, I went through all that. I'm never letting it happen like that again. <laughs> and you and I both know, I, I want to, so that um, the viewers out there understand that, that this is not just related to real estate. I mean, we know people declutter before they, they do real estate and, and we run into that together all the time, but your business is not say real estate related, you know? No. No, it's um, a, it's for anyone who just decides, I don't want to live like this anymore. I don't want to pay my bills late anymore because I can't do, because I can't find them. I don't want to arrive late for work anymore because I can't find my car keys. I can't remember where I put them, that kind of thing. This impacts daily life so much for everyone, ADHD or no, that it, it's, I would consider it to be an, es an essential just to make you more productive and happy. Yeah. And, and, you know, oftentimes when there's a lot of clutter, that's when things tend to get a little bit messy. So it also, you know, mm -hmm. it's a, it's a good habit to practice, you know, yes. just keeping things, yeah, keeping things in order. Um, so how do they reach you, Kitty? Um, they can visit my, <coughs> excuse me, they can visit my website, uh, www.cluttersolutionsbykitty.com. While they're there, if they would like to, I'd love it if they were to download my seven easy steps to conquer clutter and streamline your productivity. Brenda, it's, this is intended as a grounding tool that uh, to, through their decluttering journey, it doesn't have lightning bolts in it, but it, it, it just reminds them of things that they already know and kind of gives them a framework to, to work through the process with them. And all my contact info is on the website as well. Oh, okay. And you do a live, web, a live webinar from your site? I am. Tell us uh, a little Sorry, <laughs> um, uh, doing a live webinar this Wednesday, May 20th at 6 p.m. Uh, it's a reprise of one I did last week, which had 59 people coming. So, it, and this one, you will be learning in this webinar where clutter comes from, who is affected by it the most, and what, how you can conquer it for good. Okay, and what's your Facebook page called, Kitty? Clutter Solutions by Kitty. All right. All right. Kitty, thank you so much for joining us today. I know I have certainly learned a lot from you, and I know that the viewers out there um, not only will love your personality, but, but your focus <laughs> and, and how you help pe move people along. So thank you so much. Thank you, Brenda. Take care now. Okay. All right. We'll talk to you later. Bye. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I hope you really enjoyed all the tips that Kitty gave us on decluttering. Like I said, we've all got this time. I know I am cleaning all the closets in my house. I'm Brenda Kay with the Halifax Home Selling Group. Reach out to me for any questions you have about real estate. 
Please like and subscribe to our channel if you enjoy our videos, and I'll see you next week. Cheers.